What's going on YouTube? One on the x room here. Today is an awesome day. We're gonna head over to our good friends at On Any Moto and check out some of the new bikes they got in. Oh man, I'm so excited because some of what they have is gonna be unique and you're gonna wanna see it. All right, we're looking at downtown Tucson. As you can see, dog marks. <laughs> our dog hauler. No, those are not my wife's nose marks, but I, mean, I guess it could be because you know she gets really excited when she sees stuff. Yeah. A mountain up there, and all of its A glory. And of course, the U of A. It's right over there. Which classes for me start on Monday? Isn't that going to be awesome? <laughs> see that car, but it's fucking cool. I can't put my finger on exactly what it is. I'm not sure. It smells of delicious raw fuel back when cars used to be, you know, awesome. Look at the meats on the back of that thing. It's a fucking cool car. I cannot, again, put my finger on what the hell it is. It's meant to be known that I'm here. I don't want any moto at fucking 7 in the morning. These guys are nuts. Maybe come out here all early and shit. <laughs> Walk in here. -na -na -na. I feel like to be safe. There's man myth the legend, Bob. <laughs> the infamous at this point. <laughs> hey, there he is. Ah. My man. What is going on? X-ram woman. All early. What's up, buddy? What's up? Yeah. <laughs> James. Hello. Good morning, everyone. Got me up at five, actually, to get here by seven. Welcome to On Any Mo Power Sports. Look at that new logo. Oh, it's so That's good. Right. New shirt. Yeah, it'd be nice if I got one. They never do that for me. You out of here, Mr. I'm out of here, man. It was good riding with Pleasure you. Pleasure riding with you. Yeah, that was great. Yeah, hell yeah. Have a good one, ride safe. Yeah, you too. This though. This is the bike. Hey, everybody. Faces of Vaughn and Yamoto. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hard at work. Big time. Oh, I had an amazing day here, morning here with Vaughn and Yamoto. And again, this was my toy box. How freaking cool is that? These bikes are brand new. They hit me up and said, hey, take them for a ride. I'm sure as hell we did. This bike, the Street Fighter, is hands down my favorite one out of the ones I rode today. The same via Augusta, Turismo Veloce, surprised the shit out of me. It was very fun, very comfortable. I feel like it rides better than Ducati, honestly. But man, this machine right here, I can see why there's so many people wanting this bike. It, it's just blows my mind. It's so comfortable, it's so fast. It's a lot more tame than the V4 um, Panigale. This bike is going to be great for the track. Still not hugely keen on the street, but it's still a good bike. It's definitely an improvement over the 959 that it replaces. You know, you get a lot of people that ask why Ducatis, why Italian bikes and not 
Japanese, European, or Japanese or BMWs, and honestly, it's the feel of them. Every bike now is fast. Every bike now is really good, and they have to be because their clientele needs them to be. But these bikes not only are beautiful to look at, but they have character to them. They have soul to them. You can feel them bucking and kicking. You feel when they're not feeling right. It's it's beyond anything you can really explain other than the way that I just did, unless you ride one yourself. And I highly encourage you to try a Ducati, try a Aprilia, try an Envy Augusta, because it'll bring you something totally different in the experience of riding. Even the Moto Guzzi's have a little quirks about them that really tell you that you're, you're on a special machine. And that's what all these bikes are, is they're special machines. There's a exclusive feeling when you actually get on these bikes that you don't get with a Honda, a Yamaha. And again, those are all great bikes, just they don't make you feel like you do when you ride these. I've had a wonderful day. I hope you all enjoy these videos that are coming. We'll get back at you later.